Thank you. Well, new this morning, volunteer fire departments really across the country are struggling to retain and recruit firefighters. Many officials say this is now putting a strain on the volunteers they do have. 48's Jasmine Cornell spoke with one local fire official about this, and she joins us now live with more. Jasmine. Lieutenant James Philly with the Monrovia Volunteer Fire Department says this isn't a new problem. Volunteer fire departments around the nation have been struggling for about 20 years. But Lieutenant Philly says right now Monrovia is doing OK. According to Philly, they have a pretty good stream of people willing to volunteer. He says they have your nine to five workers, senior level management at local engineering companies, college students and high school students in their junior program. Of course, volunteer levels are different all around the county with more and more homes and businesses being built. The need is only growing. Philly says while Monrovia isn't short at the moment, they're always looking for more help. Our district is growing tremendously, especially with the additions of developments like Cliff Farm. With the devel developments like that, our call volume is going up. Last year we ran about 2300 calls for service, which is almost six and a half calls a day. And so of our current staff, that does put a pretty big stretch on the people that we have. So. We're always looking for more people. More people will always lessen the load for us. Philly says if they add 10 additional people to their staff who are committed and can run the calls, it would be extremely helpful. He says if you're interested in being a senior firefighter, you have to be 18 years old and must pass a background check and drug screening. They don't require any previous experience or training. Reporting live, I'm Jasmine Cornell. Gina to you.